Lightweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 206 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, Bam Bam. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon. You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. They touch him up, and we are underway. Ready. You ready to fight? All right, so lofty expectations for this matchup as round one gets underway. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but on the other, truly a fighter who can do it all. And that guy will usually have the advantage on paper. When you're a striker at this guy's level, that will normally balance out whatever advantage the other guy has. Well, he told you off the top he had the reach advantage, and you saw it right there with that punch. Lee gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense here. Rockham suck him out of the suit here. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Well, he continues to offer up the kick here, but just misses with that one. All right, he lands a hook there, DC. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. When you throw a hook, it can go around the guard of your opponent. Big punch land. Ooh. Slips the left hand. Oh, nice job landing the knee there. He's got a lot of size for this division and put it to good use there. Missed with that right hand. Oh, and he caught the kick. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Look at him working at trying to set the liver down. And just misses with that big right hand. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Beautiful hit kick. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, spinning back fist. He didn't telegraph that one at all. Massive head kick. All right, lands a kick there. Pretty well done. Really good accuracy landing that kick. Just out of the range with that right hand. Good stick. Just out of range with that right hook. He loaded up on that right hand, too. Telegraph that spinning back fist. And he landed the right hand there. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Oh, there's the swing and there's the miss by Lee. Oh, really using his reach advantage as he landed the jab there. Big head kick land. We need the takedown now. 
Well, not much of a setup there. Misses with the left hook. Ooh, big shot lands. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Lee gets tagged with that jab. Pretty good weapon for him tonight. Oh, big roundhouse attempt just misses. That could have been lights out. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Nice leg kick land. All right, so he continues to use his jab effectively here, DC. He gets that hand to the target pretty quick. I mean, just right away, blast the jab after jab after jab. He's a phenomenal boxer with a vast understanding of fighting behind that educated jab. Oh, bone on bone, shin slash foot, right to the skull. You see why I'm a commentator? Oh, huge connection playing there. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. Nice one, two there. Oh, nice jab there. He told us on Thursday he wanted to break this dude's nose. That is certainly a step in the right direction. Mission accomplished. Ah. You are battering that nose. All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed a seminal blow in that round. It was accumulation of those strikes. He kept hitting it over and over to the head. Eventually, he found the, the one that really did damage his opponent. really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Just misses with that one. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. There, DC. Another punch landed. Nice job on hiding that head kick. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Got clip with the right hand. Beautiful kick. Well, as my favorite rap group Onyx would say, stick and move, right? Huh. Beautiful slip off the center line there. Yeah, what a great job of moving his head. It doesn't take much to avoid a punch. Just missing on the high kick there. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. his opponent can take. Master shot that he landed. Great job. All right, so you got to be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't want to mess around for too long. Let's go. Get him off. Under three minutes now to go on the round. could come here at any time. Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two, much more aggressive than we saw in round one, and now starting to find himself in the pocket. Nice punch by Lee. Slips the punch. Oh, a huge block there. No problem getting inside to land that straight punch. He's got a huge edge in reach, and he made good use of it there. Just unable to quite find that range. Oh, what a Johnny Coleman. Now his opponent 
in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. Did not like the guy high. And now he's got a good bad. Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Oh, that's a hell of a kick right there. He told us Thursday that he was going to be kick heavy tonight, and that is certainly a step in the right direction. He is landing that strike. He's very effective with it. Nice head kick. Well, not much set up behind it. The right hook misses. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the <laughs> whole platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found the set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Lee gets caught with that punch. Nice body kick. Oh, misses with the jab. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Got to be careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. All right, there's the clapper. Ten seconds to go. Effective punch there by Lee. Ten minutes in the books. All right, there's the horn signifying the end of the round, and certainly for one party, he's fortunate to still be in this fight after that big knockdown. Oh, the fact that he was able to get up off the floor and survive to the next round. Now the corner's got some work to do. They gotta get water over his head, cool him down, try to get the bearings back about him before he goes back out there and tries to change the course of the fight. Third round underway. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. Flips the guard, lands the right hand. Massive head catch. Big kick land. Slips the shot. What a tricky head kick. Punch over the top. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Oh, body kick attempt here, it's no good. Nice defense there, huge block. So he counters with an effective punch there, and at least in that situation, it paid to have the advantage in which. Good series of strikes for him there, staying busy and staying accurate. I mean, the accuracy is unbelievable. Lee gets touched by that kick there. Oh, and he lands another knee there, DC. He talked a lot to us about his length and his size advantage. Doesn't always pay to be the taller fighter. In this instance, it certainly did. Beautiful, straight counter. Beautiful body kick land right under the elbow. Just over three minutes now to go. Big punch land through the middle. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body. Uh, lands a good series of kicks there, DC. It really didn't take him long to get a good beat on his opponent. He figured the timing, and now he's been driving kick after kick into his opponent. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Just misses with a left hook there. 
So I'm not sure if he's lighter on his feet or what it is, but these last couple of rounds, he's been far more aggressive, a lot more pressure. Oh, he's really starting to light him up now. Right under the elbow. Beautiful punch. There's no give on that leg kick. Flipped him with the right hand there. Fruit punch. That's not very good, huh? <laughs> Fruit punch. <laughs> Dude's in a good flow state, landing punch after punch. Nice counter with the hook shot there by Lee. He got the turtle in that kick. Oh, nice. Well, you didn't see a lot of the body work from him in the earlier rounds, but he's certainly getting after it here. Big shot to the body connects there. We'll see if he can follow it up. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Obvious redness on the right side of his body. Big kick land. Lee getting tattooed by that stiff jab. Kick there, blocked by Lee. Nice punch lands over the top. Looking to land the right hand, he misses. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. That right hand landed. Changes his stance. You'll see a lot of this from this fighter. Thirty seconds, not a. Fifteen seconds. Over and over and land a big body kick. Lands a knee there. Nice deception there to get that knee to the target. Really good knee. Nice job of driving the right to the target. Get the plan exactly where you want. All right, so let us now check out some of the action in that round, DC. There was a whole lot of it, including a stunner upstairs that nearly closed the show. It was a lot of action. It was back and forth action. But the big moment was that big strike to the head that landed that put him on wobbly legs and then survival mode. Luckily, he made it to the end of that round. All right, so next round underway here, and you gotta admire the stamina that both of these guys still exuded towards the end of that round. Both men put a particular focus on their cardiovascular commitment in this training camp, and it's clearly paid dividends here tonight. We have two legitimately fresh fighters here as we hit this next round. Connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. Ball right, then a left. Oh, he lands and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Keep your hands up for me. Come on. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Big head kick land. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Well, the is a huge shot there, DC. I'm not sure how he stayed up. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, to stay standing shows and talks to your toughness. How good is that right hand? All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. 
Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Pretty good work with the strikes here off of his back by Lee. Well, the right hand has been there at times, not that time. Oh, man, this is one thing you, you do not want to get kicked in the head at MMA. You cannot take too many of those head kicks, but this guy gets his leg up there so fast, sometimes you don't see it coming. Big left hook coming, it's blocked. Goes again, working off that beautiful jab. He continues to keep his opponent at distance. I mean, keeps him at bay with that beautiful, precise jab. It is like a piston. It goes in. Over the top. This fight's going to be over. This what a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stand forth. He mixed it up. He went high with his low. And now he's got to hurt very badly. Action here. Let's go. Let's get the takedown. Oh, big punch land. And now he goes with the combination of punches to the head. Potentially some concussive damage there. I mean, absolutely concussive damage. Landing all those strikes to the head. He's very accurate. He's very fast. And he has a real confidence every time he throws his punches. Just misses there with the left. Oh, nice right hand. Switching stances here. Big kick lands. Connects with the right. Just misses with the jab. That one stuck in. Nice strike. Nice body right up the elbow. 30 seconds left. 30 seconds left in the round. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Goes to the body there. So, near perfect execution on the strike that ultimately results in the KO here tonight. All right, let's take a look back at the replay. It ends up a knockout, but this was really a striking clinic from the ball that they touched. I mean, a competitive fight that one guy finally found the shot that ended the fight. But both of these warriors displayed a ton of heart. One guy got the finish, but neither guy should be disappointed in their performance. All right, the official decision is in. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 44 seconds of round number four. Playing the winner by...